Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Well, today I want to do first impression slash review on a new foundation I picked up, and this is the Double Wear Estee Lauder Foundation. This retails for $37. I heard this foundation through YouTube. I heard a lot of people talk about it how and how awesome it is. They they say it's a full coverage, and I've heard a lot about it. I color is in the color uh, 3W2 in Cashew. It comes available in 30 shades, which is always great. Um, and to this moment, I really, really do like it i feel that it is uh, it blended into my skin really well um it did awesome i mean it looks really really nice really flawless into my skin it covered all my imperfections it, I, the only thing i didn't like was that it doesn't have a pump which can be a little messy but it does come available in many shades so that's a really good advantage um and yeah it says that it's in the back of the box it says that it has a 15 hour staying power that looks fresh and flawless through heat, humidity, and non-stop Hey guys, so I am back. Um, it is about 11.15 right now um, and I did go eat breakfast and I did apply this and um, so yeah, so let's see how it, uh, the foundation is doing. Um, I only apply bronzer, blush, and highlight. Um, my eyebrows and my eyelashes normal for normal makeup routine. And as of now, I see it looks flawless. I mean, it looks awesome. I'm, to this moment, I really, really have enjoyed it. So let's see how it does, uh, maybe like around 2 or 3 in the afternoon. And I'll come back and let you guys know how it's doing. Hey guys, I am back. So it is officially about um, 1.30, 1.40 and I am back. The foundation looks awesome. I mean, um, I don't see a problem with it. I am barely going to leave. This is my outfit. I'm not sure if you can see in it. It's just a pencil skirt with a black um, shirt. I got a Ross. And yeah. Hey guys, so I am back. It is officially about 5.21 in the afternoon. I'm not sure if you guys can pick it up, but it is officially 5.21 in the afternoon. And I want to check on this foundation, so let's see how it's doing. From what I can see, it does look a little bit oily, especially right now that it's like a little uh, hot. It's like uh, probably like in the 90s right now. And um, I do see that it's a bit oily. Um, especially in my T-zone, but always that always tends to happen, especially because I was out. I did go to um, a, a two-hour event, so I did do that. But other than that, I feel that all the imperfections are covered. Um, I do like this foundation. Honestly, I feel that it didn't oxidate, and I do recommend it. I feel that I just love it. Um, I love the coverage. I love that it looks natural and it doesn't look too cakey. Especially, it doesn't feel like I'm wearing anything. It feels like so natural, and I just love it. So I do recommend it. Um, it does come available, like I mentioned in the beginning. It does come available in 30 shades. I do recommend it, and hopefully. You guys Guys, enjoy this first impression slash review. Give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.